River, Shake Milton missing, Matisse Thibel, Mike Scott, Furkan Korkmaz all out there for the first time, and it's Furkan to steal away that dart from Jokic. Thibel hits for a three, and he got it. Good to see Matisse Thibel hitting the three-pointer, and for the Sixers, it is their first of this first quarter. Now we have a timeout with three and change to play in. Not the start we want, especially defensively. 76ers making up for it. Matisse for the first time in his four-year NBA career. Matisse Thibel able to answer at the other end. The Sixers needed something positive. And what do you know? Thibel, another three. Just get stops and make buckets. Scott here with a hot potato, hits the... Apparently the shot came in. Close enough some more. That's just a bad pass from Gordon. That's not Porter's fault. He should have been able to capitalize. Shake Milton back into the game. He's Thibel. Howard working hard for the money here. Don't forget to join us at halftime. Sixers Halftime Long Live, sponsored by your local Delaware Valley Acura dealers on NBC Sports Philadelphia. Against that pick and roll, something he has gotten, as you see the contact being absorbed, he has gotten a lot better. The best season of his 10-year NBA career. It's remarkable. The yep. movements everywhere. Yeah, Jokic. That's green off the merry miss. Let's look for Thibel who slams for two. He was fouled as well, or was he? I heard a whistle. I thought it was a foul. On Looking up ahead, that's a nice little pass to Matisse. Merry over at Thibel. Since. Second unit providing some energy, making all the difference in this point. Uh, we've seen him nights where he's absolutely been deadly against the 76ers. Despite him being cold, the rest still with more than enough. Comes to an end, a 104 95 win for the Denver Nuggets. And the Sixers will now travel to Cleveland and they will take on the Cavaliers.